like to introduce the brother unit. And the first thing I notice when you put your hand on this is the industrial built sturdy powder coat finished cage that's on here that's unlike the wire cages. It's going to add an extra source of protection against intentional and unintentional things maybe caused by weed eaters or kids. There's two screws that hold in the base valve. Most of them only have one. With two screws, it's not going to twist, which will eliminate any chance of creating leaks when undoing these caps or when tightening them back up. They've also had the bug shield on here because we want all of our bugs to live long lives and we don't want our lizards to fry. We want them to live free so they can eat the bugs that get in here in the first place. So When removing this, the first thing I notice is all the insulated terminal ends that are on everything on this. Uh, every wire on here is insulated, which is going to help hold up, especially in our Florida conditions, to the corrosion factors. We also have an extra lead wires that are coming out here to be used for a couple of things. Their main purpose is for optional equipment. Or when that whip just isn't quite long enough and all we needed was three more inches of wire, you could disconnect it here and make your connections onto these terminals. They're already ready to go. Stick them in, put your butt ends on there, and crimp them down. It would make a real nice connection if you needed that extra wire. It would be there for you. The high pressure safety switch shuts the power off to the unit, to the 24 volts, relieving the power to the unit, so that if we get into a clogged dryer through improper installation or a clogged metering device, we're not going to burn up this compressor. Uh, it's going to shut the unit down and keep it from going into an overload situation or even a thermal lock, which would then take more time and a lot of times maybe misdiagnosed when the winding opens up due to a thermal load and then we're sending out a new compressor only for the new one to do the same thing. So great, great feature they put in here. The one thing I really liked about this is when you pull this off, a lot of your competitors, you had to hold this up in the air because you didn't have enough wire. Now what it allows you to do is bring this down to the ground so the technician now has all the wires and a little bit of room to work. Pulling this cover off, the first thing I noticed was this foam that ran all the way around, this foam gasket. It's put in the top of here and where it lines up is on the outer foam of the metal shroud that goes all the way around it. This is going to highly cut down on vibrations and this unit is going to run a lot quieter simply because of the amount of screws they put around the edge to hold it together and that foam gasket which is going to make that seal. Uh, the compressor in here, I'll be happy to say, is a Copeland scroll and it is a Copeland scroll that we carry right off the shelf. So we have the replacement compressors for these uh, all the time. And there's just so many extra features on this unit uh, that I'm not seeing on any of the entry level units that's just really impressing me. I really and highly recommend uh, this unit for the multifamily housing industry. I think it's going to be a great fit. Thank you for listening.